Hi everyone, this is SolidWorks 2018. Open a part, go to front plan, open a sketch, uh, just give it any dimension 300 by <coughs> 300. Just extrude 30 mm. Okay. So in 2018, if you want to sketch top of that, you don't have to make again a sketch. Now, if you go to sketch again and see there is a offset on surface, you just select the surface and give it offset maybe offset 50 mm now there is your 50 mm offset and uh, okay now you want to extrude the from from surface from here and here you'll specify the direction going you want to merge or not so it's, this part is created and next if you go to all wizard uh, okay and to select the hole, simple hole. Here I will select metric and tap draw. Actually, <coughs> I want to tap here 16 mm, 16 by 2. This is a normal pitch on 16 mm bolt. So now you will see through all there is some setting and 3d sketch i'm not giving i'm not going to give any dimension or just select four corner okay select okay so now you will see tab drill for 16 mm by 2 and if I just click inside you can see the hole is 14 mm because I made this hole for the tapping if I make a hole here 16 mm so as you know then I cannot tap here 16 mm <coughs> then maybe I need 18 mm for the tapping so therefore there is a hole 14 mm and just go to a thread thread feature and uh, here I will select a cylindrical face that is this one and I will go to uh, you see it's automatically now it find it's a 14 mm hole and automatically it uh, pop up the right size that I can tap here 16 mm it's a metric tap you can choose here die inch die or whatever it's a metric tap it's the right one and I need to cut the thread inside this hole and go down it's the right hand side or is the left hand thread multi start <coughs> the, what is the nice feature is here the trim with start face and trim with end face and uh, I'm just going to say okay input data or created is not completed Oh, because I did not give the dimension 
I did not give the the length how deep I want to make a thread so in this case I will say up to selection and I will select the bottom part because I want the thread through all press ok so now you have a very nice thread so nicely done in this in this hole and once again I want to show you if you don't trim the thread now let's see what this looks like you see there so, okay thank you very much for watching this video see you in next video